Hey, what's up everybody? Dr. Scott here. I'm going to talk a little bit today about a big subject here about inflammation and what causes inflammation in your body and talk about the top seven things. But first off, you have to understand a little bit more about what infl inflammation exactly is. So there's acute inflammation in the body, which is your body's natural defense against viruses and bacteria and or when you, you know, cut your arm, it heals. Those are natural inflammatory responses in the body that only last for a few days uh, and your body heals. It's actually part of your immune system, part of your healing process. Uh, the, the part that is damaging to your body is more chronic inflammation, but this is more a systemic thing that actually can last for months, even years in some cases, and then people get treated by all sorts of things and medications and different kinds of surgeries and ends up being a real downward spiral. It causes you know, all sorts of diseases. Almost every disease in your body is associated with this. Uh, abnormal weight gain, low energy, poor sleep, you name it. So the, the top seven causes of inflammation in the body are inflammatory diets. So this is, this is a, a big, big issue with processed foods and sodas and diet sodas and all these uh, energy drinks uh, out there, box foods, lots of high in sugar and processed sugars, uh, so which causes blood sugar imbalances, so you start having high blood sugar. Uh, your body can't really get rid of the sugar out of the blood as easy as it used to, so these in blood sugar imbalances are a big factor in this chronic inflammation. Um, leaky gut syndrome, um, sleep loss, so just, just not getting enough sleep. So if you're someone that stays up really late on your computer, for example, and of course kids are doing that these days, uh, playing games, whatever it is, these things can lead to bigger problems down the road because it really causes, your body needs sleep, for example, to keep the, to heal properly, to keep your nerve system in balance. So if you don't have that, it causes a lot of imbalances. Uh, chronic stress in your life, Again, not being able to deal with or manage stress pro properly in your life uh, is key or being able to uh, deal with the stress you do have because we all have stress. Environmental toxins, again, we're going to get those. Your body's designed to handle some of those, but if we just add more stuff in in our, in our house, things that we have control of that we can, we can get rid of or clean up or use a, a more natural uh, source of something like a cleaning solution or laundry detergent, these are areas where we can really have an effect on the, the toxic burden that we have on a day-to-day -day basis. And then chronic infections, these things are things that just, you know, or keeps us uh, exposing ourselves to things that, that cause these chronic infections. So uh, read the article below. You also, there's a link at the bottom for a voucher to come in the office as well. Uh, and we have a couple of those for either nutritional consults or chiropractic consults. And uh, look forward to talking to you guys the next time. Dr. Ewing signing off.